Hi everyone, on this video I'm going to show you how our students can split their screen on their Chromebook. Now you're probably saying, Mrs. Schwartz, why in the world would my child want to split their screen? I'm going to show you right now. So I am researching sea turtles because who doesn't love sea turtles? They're adorable. So on this screen I've got my sea turtles that I'm reading about here in National Geographic, but then I have to go over to this other tab at the top um, to get to my Google Doc, where I'm then paraphrasing my facts that I learned. Well, this can be kind of a tough for our kids to toggle back and forth. So I'm going to teach you a quick trick. And this is a keyboard trick. And so on your student's keyboard, you're going to want to find the Alt button and then these two bracket buttons here at the top. You only need to click one of the bracket buttons because um, the left bracket pushes everything to the left side of the screen, or you could do the right bracket, which would push it to the right of the screen. So you only need to press one. So let me go back here and I will show you what happens when I press that. So I'm in my sea turtles. I'm pressing alt and one bracket and it splits my screen there. So then I can take that sea turtle fact page and just drag it over here to the other side. And now look at that. I can see my article and my Google Doc both at the same time, which makes it a lot easier for some of our kids. Another example of when you might want to do this is if you are maybe on a Zoom call with your teacher. So I've got my Zoom call going on, but my teacher also wants me to play Kahoot, right? So if I do, once again do Alt and one of the brackets, remember, let me show you my keyboard again so you know what that looks like. Alt and then just one of these bracket keys. So I'll do an alt and a bracket key and it's going to split it and then I can take my zoom call and just slide it over here so it's on the other side and then I can see both at the same time. How nifty is that? When you are done with your split screen and you want it to go back to full size, you can just press this square at the top there and it will make it full size again for you. I hope that helps. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to your to your child's teacher or the tech department. Thanks.